Orange County residents have to say goodbye to the sand and waves for now because of the governor's order. But what does that mean for our local beaches? KSBY's Megan Healy tells us how we can avoid local closures. At Avila Beach, you can still walk, run, and enjoy the coastline. I mean, take a look at how many people here came out to enjoy this beautiful afternoon. Well, most beaches and state parks in San Luis Obispo and Santa Barbara counties are open. In order to keep them that way, local law enforcement tells me people still have to maintain that social distance and avoid large crowds. Today, beaches in Orange County are, are closed. Nobody can go down there and enjoy it. Many thought that was going to be the case for all California beaches and state parks. Local agencies like the Port St. Louis Harbor Patrol saw news that Governor Newsom could issue a statewide closure. So they prepared for the possibility. The biggest issue is uh, staffing and resources. Do we have the manpower to really block a public beach from not allowing anyone to be on it? We avoided local closures and many want to keep it that way. In order for us to be able to do that, we need to keep our beach numbers low and continue to see social distancing. In Montaña de Oro, this seascape photographer says closures could prevent him from taking pictures of this. Montana at Spooner's Cove. But he says he would understand if more restrictions were issued. If they're serious about it, well, I'll just hang it up for a while. Yeah, people are, a lot of them are too dumb to look out for their own health. So, yes, I think they're reasonable. San Luis Obispo County Sheriff Ian Parkinson is not in favor of closures, saying in an Instagram post he does not plan to make criminals out of people who need to walk, run, or enjoy the beach for their mental health. Last weekend, Harbor Patrol made about 750 contacts on the beach, hoping to prevent rule breakers. Really heavily educating people. We want them to understand why these restrictions have been put in place and we want them to understand that they are helping us keep the beach open by following the local shelter homeowners. I'm told no citations were given out at Pismo Beach last weekend when we saw crowds of people. San Luis Obispo Public Health officials are asking tourists to stay away and many people are hoping they listen so that what happened in Orange County doesn't happen here. Reporting in Avila Beach, I'm Megan Healy, KSBY News. In a statement sent to KSBY, the California Police Chiefs Association addressed the memo sent out last night about expected statewide beach closures, saying the evolving discussion about crowded beaches was regrettably shared outside of our police chief membership, and we apologize for the unique or the undue concern that it caused to the public.